I don't know about you, but the first thing I do each morning is brush my teeth. And the second thing I do is come down to my kitchen and make myself a coffee. I can't afford any fancy coffee machines and I don't profess to be a barista. But here is what I think is the best way to make instant coffee. These videos are about my opinion. If you don't like it, then don't watch it. I've been drinking this stuff for many years now and my technique has changed dramatically. And I think I've finally perfected the art. I like my coffee strong, but not too strong. I almost use two teaspoons of sugar. This is personal preference. You add as much or as little as you want. I won't judge you. Unless you have three sugars or more, then I will definitely judge you. The bang average way that everyone makes their coffee is this. Coffee, sugar, boiling water, give it a stir, add some milk. Although this is the easiest, this is the worst for taste. First of all, if you're boiling already boiled water instead of filling the kettle up, then you're using water with a lower oxygen content as it's been overboiled. Always boil fresh water. Science. Anyway, the problem with that method is when you add the boiling water directly to the coffee beans, it actually burns them, or at the very least, affects the flavour. The coffee doesn't turn out right, and although it's a decent cup of coffee, there are ways that we can improve on this. Through working in an office, I was told a better way. It goes like this. Firstly, to your mug, add the coffee, then the sugar. Then before the water, you add the milk. This coats the coffee granules with nice cold milk, meaning that when you do add the boiling water, it doesn't have as strong as an impact on the beans, resulting in a smoother taste. I followed this method for about a year or two, and it served me very well, resulting in better cups of coffee, and once you do it, you'll probably never go back. Note, this does not apply to tea. If you put the milk first in with tea, you deserve to be shot. but we can go one step further to really produce the best cup of coffee you've ever had. This was shown to me by a friend of my grandfather, a wise old man who actually fought in the war, so I had to trust him. So this is the best way to make instant coffee. First, the coffee, then the sugar, then the milk. And here is the special touch. Place this mug into the microwave for 30 seconds. This brings the milk to temperature slowly it allows the coffee to dissolve slightly in the milk and you can see leaves a nice silky layer on top. You see that? You want it to look like the surface of Jupiter. When stirred with the boiling water, you will notice it leaves a good, flavorful crema on the top, which you typically only find in barista style coffees. But through some wizardry, I have brought to this cup. Another great thing about this is your mug will be hotter for longer. And that is great news for all. So that's it. Give it a go and tell me what you think. If you like this video, then like and subscribe for more. Or not, I'll get over it.